History buffs gather round. Ever heard about the VP who took his oath in Cuba? Meet William R. King. William R. King, the 13th Vice President of the United States, holds a unique spot in history. He took his oath of office in Cuba due to his poor health, I imagine that. Born in 1786, King was a politician and diplomat who served as a US representative and senator. He even helped draft the Compromise of 1850. In 1853, suffering from tuberculosis, King was allowed to take his oath in Cuba, making him the US VP to be inaugurated on foreign soil. Sadly, King died just 45 days later without ever performing his duties. Despite his short tenure, King left a lasting legacy. Places like King County in Washington and the King Residence Quadrangle at UNC honor his name. So the next time you hear about a VP, remember William R. King, the man who made history from Cuba.